Morning, everyone. Thank you for joining me today for our usual Monday morning live. For those of you who don't know me, I am Hannah and I own Duck Lane Books, which is an independent as born business. Um, and today I wanted to share with you um, the first of my top five reasons why I love my as born business. And um, part one today is friendships. So um, <clears throat> I joined Asborn at a time when my mental health wasn't great. Um, I was on the tail end of uh, getting over postnatal depression and my marriage had recently ended as well. So I was in a very dark place, to be honest with you. Um, joining Asborn has brought me friendships that I never thought in a million years I would find. Um, people who do as born come from all different walks of life. Um, you've got stay at home parents, uh, teachers. Um, one of my friends is a paramedic. We've got people who are childcare workers. Um, one of my friends who does as born is a wedding photographer. And during the pandemic, they've just taken their business has really taken off, which is amazing because wedding photography business is not booming at the moment. I've got friends who work in the legal sector, who are nurses, physios, accountants, like there's no kind of one size fits all um, when it comes to joining as born and making a go of your business. Um, we've all got a common goal um, that we love children's books and we love being a part of as born books at home. So we all bring different things to our business, but we've all got so many things in common as well. Um, over the last 18 months or so that I've been doing as born, um, I have made some amazing friendships, um, some of which are with people that I've never actually met. Um, over lockdown, we do regular um, Zoom meetings and um, Facebook lives and various things. and going to these regular meetings um it can either be just a catch-up and sharing some tips and ideas or it could be like um a training session about something to do with working with schools or whatever but yeah during these kind of zoom sessions you get to know different people and the people that kind of go to them regularly and over the months these friendships have blossomed and some of these people I count as my best friends, despite the fact that we haven't met in person because we haven't been able to because I can't travel to go and see them. But we talk regularly on WhatsApp and we do FaceTime and various other things. But it's really interesting how you just find so many different things in common with people when you catch up and have that exchange of conversation over Zoom meetings or a WhatsApp messenger chats um like a group chat type thing it's yeah it's been really amazing but um one of the most important friendships for me that i have found that i never would have thought possible is the ones that i've got with my asborn mentor and with the people who signed up to do asborn with me as my team um i'm really lucky that my asborn mentor only lives about a 5 minute walk away from me um so if i need help with anything um, then it's literally a short walk. Um, if there's a book that I need for a customer that isn't in stock, I can go and collect it from her and we will swap stock over and help each other out that way. But also if it's just something like a doorstep visit, um, it's been really nice over lockdown having these friendships grow and blossom because they have become a bit of a lifeline for me. Um, my my friendship with my mentor has almost become like family now um, when things were a bit more relaxed with our lockdown restrictions, much to our detriment. Um, we've shared things like having a family takeaway together. We've gone Christmas shopping together. We've had play dates and kind of work dates in the garden when the weather was beautiful and and got some work done while my little girl was playing in the paddling pool and things um it's yeah it's just been absolutely incredible i've got team members as well that live really close nearby like either a short drive or a short walk away but then i've also got team members that live at the opposite end of the country to me 
Um, and it never feels like we're that far away because we catch up over WhatsApp and Messenger and we have video calls with each other. Um, just last night, I caught up with one of my, a couple of my team members on a video call and we were in our comfies and our PJs just having a catch up, um, talking about how our week has been, but then also talking about our business and sharing tips and ideas um, about how we can help our businesses to grow. Um, I usually have a Sunday planning session um, in the evening once my little girl is in bed and my team members know that they can always get hold of me in that time and I'm always there for a catch up and it's just a nice way to help set each other up for the week as well. Um, it's so rewarding to be able to share my Osborne journey with other people, not just my family, but my team members and my mentor and people who are in my wider team as well. Um, we've all got each other's backs and it's so nice that we can celebrate small wins as well as the big achievements like a promotion or um, helping a school out with a um, sponsored reading event and getting thousands of pounds worth of books for them. It's yeah, it's absolutely incredible. And I find sometimes that female camaraderie can be quite hard to come by, especially when you are an adult and a mum. Um, but with Usborne, I've discovered that I have it in spades and these women are my army. They've always got my back. They're always there to kind of cheer me on um, and support me when I'm having a rough day. But they are the first ones that will be there as well to celebrate with me when things go right as well. So that is just one of the reasons why I love having my Usborne business. If you would like to talk to me a little bit more about joining Usborne, then please feel free to get in touch with me. Um, if not, I will catch you all same time tomorrow with part two. Take care, guys. Have a lovely Monday. Bye.